hello youtube welcome back to my video in this video i am going to show you how to solve uh, the error uh, which is coming while uh, connecting your mysql workbench to your mysql database okay so this is my uh, local instance created with my uh, username and password uh, which is already uh, saved so if i'm just uh, double clicking that to trying to connect uh, mysql database you can see i'm getting an error cannot connect uh, to database server your connection item failed for user uh, from your host to the server local host uh, authentication plugin caching sh2 password cannot be loaded okay so all you have to do is to solve this error uh, you have to execute a an sql command uh, in mysql first you have to open your mysql command line clients uh, which is uh, this one mysql command line uh, not this one uh, yeah this one mysql command line client okay just open this and put your password so my password is uh, root one two three so i have just logged in in mysql uh, command line so yeah uh, the uh, command you have to execute this i'll, I'll write here it's uh, alter user and you have to give the username so my username is root and i'm connecting to my local host okay so i have to write like local host and then identified by uh, identified uh, with okay identified uh, with my sql native password okay and one more by have to give the password so my password i'm giving to as uh, root one two three okay yes we have successfully uh, done uh, created that sql uh, query we can just paste down in our mysql command line and just press enter and uh, let it uh, uh, be executed yes it's executed well and now we have to just uh, uh, restart our mysql server so just open your services in your windows and just search for mysql and i'm going to restart this okay just uh, select restart and wait for your mysql to be restarted yes the mysql has been so mysql server has been restarted now go back to your uh, mysql workbench and if you are if you are just double clicking that you can successfully login in your mysql workbench okay yes we have successfully logged in in my mysql workbench you can see uh, i have a uh, only one database test 001 i'll show you here show databases okay uh, the connection is lost i I'll, I'll have to log in again root one two three okay so let me show you again show databases yes so i have uh, this data database test zero zero one okay so i don't have any table in the if uh, it's still having the error you have to update uh, this local host with uh, uh, the ip address like uh, the uh, local host ip address 127.0.1 and if it's uh, again uh, after updating that 127.0.1 ip address get your ip address from uh, your uh, your pc like uh, if you are just opening your uh, network places you can see your pc ip so mine is connected to wi-fi just click on wi-fi so i can see my ip address here if i am double clicking here see this this is my ip address so what i have to do is if uh, this is my ip address i'll have to update it like uh, this one this is 192.168.1.103 okay 192.168.1.103 okay and you have to put this ip address while connecting to your mysql workbench okay so we have uh, successfully uh, found a solution for the error which we are getting on uh, logging in uh, in mysql database using workbench hope you got this if you have any doubt in this please comment below i'll be helping you and please like and subscribe for my videos and thanks for watching